Hi, my name is Brooklyn and I have been doing a 10 week psychological study on nightmares. So I wanted to give you a quick recap of week one, which was a control week. So the average time I went to bed every night was around 1240. Nine is the average time I woke up every day. I had zero nightmares the first week, which is unusual for me as I normally have a lot, which is why I started the study. So no nightmares the first week. I had 15 dreams in seven days, which is an average of about two dreams per night. And then five of those dreams were work related because I obviously work a lot. Um, so I dream about work a lot. And then three of those dreams, I do not remember at all. Either they weren't significant or I just had so many in one night, I just can't remember one of them. So three of them, I can't remember at all. And then there were three dreams that I found a little bit of significance in. The first one was work related, but it was really interesting to me. That was the first dream I had on, in this study. I was at work and for some reason we were getting done at 10 o'clock. We were ready to go, ready to get out the door. I was ready for bed and my cashier who's really sweet she let in a whole bunch of elderly people and i decided to just let them in i didn't want to but i was like okay i'll just give you some coffee and some pastries or something like that and you can just chill for a little bit i'll just let you stay for a little bit but they took their time and they were having a great time at 10 o'clock at night for some reason and they were drinking coffee and they were older people so it didn't make any sense but i remember distinctly telling my cashier to just say no next time just say no i kept saying that why can't you just say no so in saying that to her, I believe I was saying that to myself in an aspect of life. Uh, maybe it was work related or school related, whatever it was, I was saying just say no to something. And then the second dream with significance happened in the middle of the week. And it was about my husband and I actually, when we were younger, um, we went through a period where we weren't together briefly. In this dream, we were actually getting married. We were supposed to be getting married. I was at my parents' house and it was storming really, really bad. Like I'm talking a hurricane storm. I was not wearing a white dress. I was wearing a coral dress. And for some reason, we just could not get married that day. Like we were, everything was ready. I had people in from everywhere and we just did not get married. So I think maybe that was reflective of that period when we weren't together briefly. And then the third dream that had significance was also work related. I was at a different location than I am now. And I got there and the employees were just partying. They were having a good time. There was a choir going on and I was just not meshing with them very well. They didn't like me because I was trying to get them to work and I meant business. But at the same time, I was very nervous. So I was dropping my keys and uh, I'm just fumbling my words. I just could not focus. So I think that was uh, reflective of what I have going on now, which I've been way overly stressed lately. So I think that dream might have been telling me to slow down a little bit and enjoy life a little bit more because I have been super stressed out. So those were the three dreams of the 15 that really had some significance. So that was week one of my 10 week psychological study on nightmares.